Hello there, my Maple Leaf fans. Welcome to the post-game show after the Maple Leafs lost 5-2 to the Florida Panthers. I'm going to take you live to the post-game. Thanks. Anytime. I am by your side. Here are five reasons why I love using Creative Fabrica. They have tons of pre made designs that I'm already allowed to use commercially and for print on demand. Number two, they have the best fonts. Strong start to the game. What, what do you think flipped in the second period? Yeah, I think we just didn't manage the puck well enough. Um, yeah, I took too many penalties. Um, and they play well. The penalties, uh, some frustration with the officiating, or you just guys got to be more disciplined? No, I think it's just about being disciplined. I mean, they're going to do their job, and it's up to us to, to skate and uh, play well, defend, and, you know, mind our sticks. So, um, you know, moving forward, uh, that's an area to clean up. You guys now locked in uh, to your playoff opponent. You're going to face Boston. What do you make of that matchup? Um, I mean, we haven't had much time to really think about it yet. So, uh, you know, we'll uh, worry about that over the next couple of days. What's the key? Uh, what do you want to focus on? One game to go in the regular season? Um, just cleaning up uh, the areas of our game that uh, uh, caused problems tonight. So, um, you know, we just want to feel good going into the first round. John, where did that game uh, get away from you tonight? Obviously, it wasn't a very good second period and uh, spent a lot of time in the box. Uh, obviously, they, they get on the board, built some momentum, and, and really got their game going. And um, we just weren't able to uh, uh, break that momentum and then generate enough in the third. So what do you think about how the game was called, John? And then you guys to be more disciplined, or was there some frustration there? Um, you know, I, I'm not going to get into it. It is what it is. I think, uh, you know, you got to be smart. Um, understand the dynamics of the game there, um, and hopefully uh, the refs get it right. So, but uh, no doubt uh, we have to be as disciplined as we can be um, when you're playing really good hockey teams like that. And, and you know, there's definitely a few that uh, um, we need to be smarter with. So, but um, yeah, we you know you just got to understand those situations and making sure you're, you're, you're being smart. What do you what feel you like the team's game is with the playoffs right around the corner? Pardon? How do you feel the team, where the team's game is at right now? Right yeah, I mean, the, the last couple here, you know, we, we haven't uh, been able to sustain uh, good portions of the game uh, that we've, uh, you know, either, you know, we haven't started well or today we had a really good start and put ourselves in a good spot. So, um, you know, understanding, uh, uh, maintaining momentum and, and then when you lose it, grabbing it back and obviously withstanding uh, the pressure, um, the momentum the other team builds. You're obviously playing really good hockey teams this time of year. And at times you're going to have to check and defend and weather the storm. Um, so one area we have to be better with. I know your head is uh, still with this game, but uh, it's determined now you'll be playing the Bruins to start things off. Just your thoughts on going up against uh, that kind of historic rival? And yeah, obviously it'll be a real challenge, but obviously uh, uh, real special to play in that. Obviously original six, it's got a lot of history to it. Uh, great opportunity for us. So. Um, we know it'll be a real test and we have to be, be prepared. What do you want to see out of your, out of your guys uh, tomorrow night to finish the season? Well, we just want to play good hockey and play uh, uh, the way we want to play. Um, you know, the, the team identity and, and uh, the level of execution and, and the things that we need to do well to give our, ourselves success and, and uh, go and get two points. Which way how did this game turn in the second? Um, obviously gave them a lot of opportunities on power plays. You know, got them feeling good. Um, they uh, track transitioned real well in that second period, and we didn't do a good enough job covering. What uh, what would you expect out of yourselves tomorrow night to finish the season? Um, I mean, just obviously another hard fought game. Um, you know, make sure we're doing everything right and cleaning everything up that uh, we messed up today in the second and third. What are your initial thoughts? Are you going to get Boston and not Florida in round one? Um, I mean, I don't think it matters. Both teams are uh, obviously had great seasons. Uh, both teams are very competitive, so um, you know, I think. Uh, Regardless of whoever we were going to play, it's going to be a competitive matchup, and um, you know now obviously uh, we're excited for that, and uh, we still got one more game left. That, like I said, we want to make sure we're ready for clean up some stuff, and um, then we'll shift our focus over there. What do you need to clean up? Um, just like I said, um, cleaning up the uh, traction, just in 
um, back to the neutral zone, starting better in the second period as well, and um, not giving as many penalties to a to a skilled team to let their guys feel good. Yeah, um, I thought it was, uh, you know, we got got behind a bit in the second period, and um, you know they're a good team and, and they lock it down defensively and everything. So once you get behind like that, it's it's definitely tough to come back and. Um, I thought we did a, a good job, you know, at least working to, to try to do everything we could to battle back. But um, you know, they're a good team, and I thought uh, Stoli had a good game. Thirty plus shots in that second period that you faced. Like, can you describe what that what it's like dealing with that? Yeah, um, I mean, it's honestly kind of nice. You don't really think too much, and you just get to play. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to do my job. What's your initial thoughts on facing the Bruins in the in the playoffs of this group, uh, Joe? Um, yeah, I just I literally just heard about ten seconds ago, so um, not not too many thoughts. I, I think you know our team is prepared for whoever we, we were going to play, and, and knowing that it could have been Florida or Boston, so um, you know I'm confident in our group and, and our preparation, and we'll be ready. So you when might you think back to the games you you did play against the Bruins. What stood out about the way they they attack? Yeah, they you know they play a playoff game uh, year round, so you know they're hard hard team to play against, and they have some big bodies, so. Um, maybe a bit different looked in Florida, but you know, we'll, be, we'll be ready. How do you feel the team's game is with one game left in the regular season, the playoffs right around the corner? Where, where are you guys at? Um, you know, I'm, I'm optimistic with with how we are, and uh, you know, obviously the last few games maybe given up you know, a bit too many goals, I think, from from our goalies' perspective, and um, you know, it's it's up to us to, to you know to, to keep our team in it as well. So um, you know, Sammy and I will be you know working to get better and, and be ready, but. Um, you know, I think our, our team uh, looks really strong at, at certain times, and um, there's times when we take over games, so I'm, I'm really confident in our group. Sheldon, where did that game go on for you guys tonight? Uh, obviously, you know, them scoring early in the second period on that first shift, that's, you know, the momentum shifts there, energy changes in the game, and then we just took too many penalties, you know, so it took away from what I thought was pretty good hockey game for us to probably kill got lots of life and momentum for them no real scoring chances I thought we managed it really well but a lot of time in our end a lot of time for our best people sitting on the bench and and a lot of defending um, you know but it's a, it's a funny game you know, we played a terrific first period and uh, the game looks a lot worse than it is from there it's we didn't give up many scoring chances in this game here tonight. Way less than we've been given up in previous games, despite what the shots say. But uh, obviously, we give up too many goals and don't get enough uh, chances or don't finish our opportunities from there. What do you think of the intensity tonight? You, you never know what you're gonna quite going to get at this time of the year. Yeah, I thought, uh, yeah, you never know what you're going to get uh, for sure. Um, but I, I thought it was a good physical, competitive first period. Um, you know, and, and uh, I thought we were obviously right there. I thought we controlled things in the first period. Uh, then, you know, they, they got going in that second period, and, and, you know, the crowd gets into it. They get life and momentum, you know. Uh, I didn't. I thought we had to get to another level in the game emotionally, and I, we didn't get there, uh, I didn't think. Um, uh, you know, so that's that's part of it, but... That's what you're going to get in these kind of games. Just your initial uh, thoughts on, on facing the, the Bruins in the, in the first round, Shelter? Uh, game 82 tomorrow. Austin didn't score tonight. He had plenty of chances. And it looked like you were kind of coaching him in a way to try to encourage that to get that tonight, regardless of the outcome. Just your thoughts on him trying and you trying. Um, I'm not sure what you're referring to. I mean, um, but, but uh, yeah, he's, well, Austin played well tonight. He had, he had a ton of chances, you know, I don't know how many shots he ended up with, but a couple are in behind the goalie, uh, you know, it's a lot of those have been falling for him, they didn't fall tonight, but you know, I liked I liked a lot about his game. Can Will he play, play tomorrow? I'm sorry? Will Austin play tomorrow? Uh, we'll, we'll talk about it, we've got 12 healthy forwards. I think Kevin was referring to the fact that you guys were down three and it was still late that there was, you pulled the goalie to, to try and well, I mean, it's that's less about Austin. It's more about the fact that we got a chance to work on our six on five and get some reps at that, and some six on four against a really good team. Um, I think you, you know, you, you take advantage of those opportunities, uh, especially against a team like that that really challenges you. So, yeah, Austin plays a role in that, but that's for me is more about getting us some reps in a very important part of the game here uh, with playoffs approaching. What would you like to see out of your team tomorrow night? 
I just like to see us play. I thought we played a good game here today in lots of ways, especially that first period. You want to start like that again? Um, there's a lot of things we'll we'll take out of that first period, um, and you know you want our special teams to be good, which they were again here tonight. Um, yeah, so that's a positive for us. Power play gets us going. Penalty kill has, you know, has is really overworked tonight, but does a good job. Those are the kind of things you you'd like to see uh, continue. And then you know we want to get out of the game healthy, which looks like we did here tonight. So um, to that end, it's a successful night. But uh, obviously, we wish we got the two points tonight.